Welcome back. That was a painless reset. Let me see if the webcam needs to be wiped. I'll wait till Mama steps out first. She's still a little touchy, temperamentally wise. Okay, the webcam looks clean. I think she might be getting a little overstimulated, so I'm going to pet her in short, short sessions. Yeah, we believe that she cannot see out of her eye at all. At best, she may be able to see just lightness and darkness. When she looks at me, she doesn't look at me face on straight. She favors her left side towards me more. I do pausey fingers. put a uh, dog mat underneath here upside down has a egg crate foam and a flat side up of course a smooth level surface provides a little bit of insulation against the bottom of the cage somebody's grumpy and if a kitten gets up to the top and decides to go flying off the edge so jump down gives a little bit more of a cushion I do have a featherweight diffuser going outside her cage. It should help her stay a bit calm. If she gets upset, again, overstimulated, I'll just open up a pop a can of food and I should earn her trust again. Talk to the belly. Get the faces hissing. She's had a really busy few days here. She's picked up as a stray by a stranger, taken to a local shelter. From there, taken to Perfect Pals. And then from Perfect Pals to the director's house, where she gave birth the next day. And then the following day, back to Perfect Pals, where she got poked and prodded again. Had her eye looked at. And then came to me. While she was at the shelter the second time, she decided that you're not, you're done poking and prodding me. I'm finished. Game over. So they, they haven't done viral testing yet. But she'll do it the next, next visit. I know you, Mama. I can read your body language. She's got to get her used to having me around.
Okay, I picked up the volume a little bit. You should be able to hear me better now. Nah, uh, uh. She's fine with me touching her babies. It's just <laughs> not touching her. So what she is doing is perfectly natural. And she came out of the kennel cage. She was rubbing up against my leg. And gave me an eye if I tried to pet her. If you've been watching the cupcake kittens, you're probably familiar with this stage. Mom, I'm facing away from you. Perfect thing. Do you want to come out? She can exit and exit as whenever she wants. The door to the top is open. That's where she'll also find her dry food and water. So I'll just sit here for a little bit. I guess I could do a short Q&A so she can listen to my voice. By Q&A, you ask questions, I may answer them. Janine is, or Corey asked how old Janine is. She is approximately two years old. Kittens didn't give her much room to edge in there. Sass asked if Mama's fur is as silky as it looks. Pretty close. Ellen asked, is Janine... The kitty with the shortest temper you have I've ever fostered. Uh, right now, I think so. Have a, Alicia asked if I ever had a kitten so determined to cruise at two days old. Not that I can recall. These are a very active batch. This gig asks if I'm going to have to mark the kittens to tell them apart. Right now, I can tell them apart by weight. I can tell Peter apart from the other because he's known to be darker. The other two have slight variations in their fur color. They're, they should be easier to tell them apart soon just because their fur is darkening. Dara asks if she reminds me of Sugar Plum. Yep. Although she hasn't bite me on the butt yet. She did give me a nip on the hand and a very tiny scratch with her teeth. But other than that, so far I've, uh, I've lucked out.
Corey asks, does the tiger pattern blanket solve the camera issue with the kittens being white? Yes, it does. It helps. This is actually, she came with this blanket when she was at uh, the director's house when she gave birth. She found that blanket, decided that she really liked this blanket, so he came with her. Question was asked, do you think her visual difficulties making her more skittish, making her a more skittish mom? No, I do not believe so. She probably, probably has been blind in that eye for so long that she's adapted to it. Her mannerism suggests that she's been blind in there for a while. I can tell the kittens apart by their weight right now. Samika asks, do you think she liked the blanket because it is camouflaged to her? Who really knows? She probably just likes it because it's soft. Mama Meow asks, how long has your eye been affected? It's probably been uh, probably for a good year. Her eye is actually smaller than her left, so it's probably been affected since kitten. Since she was a kitten. And it will very likely need to be removed. If, if she can't see through it, and when she looks at me, she d does not face me straight on. She always angles her head to favor her left side with her good eye and if she if she can see anything out of that eye it's probably just lightness and darkness um, right now it would be better for her to have the eye removed because her inner eyelid is basically grafting itself to her eye and that could become painful over time She, probably, she had eye herpes, which is a very common in cats, but the te most cats do not ever develop symptoms, and symptoms typically manifest itself as a weepy eye or a tearing eye, and it seems to get worse during stressful situations. Her eye likely got infected with the, or the severe herpes infection when um, it may have been damaged when she was younger. Sue says that she seems to be very comfortable with the kittens. Probably not her first litter as a mom. No, I do not believe this is her first litter. She seems to be pretty experienced with handling kittens. Welcome, Witty Kitty. It it's it can pass cat to cat, but there is there's a it's an old injury, so the kittens should not be at risk. Peter, you're going the wrong way. People were asking about why she does the air kneading. It's just a comfort. She's happy. And happy cats tend to knead. And if they're not kneading on against the surface, they'll need the air. Nope. <laughs> not ready for scratching yet. I have to pay her first with food. Go on over, Peter. You know how to get to Mama. Listen for her purrs. 
The kittens are two days old. They were born midday on the 25th, so they're a little, a little over two and a half days. There you go, boy. The one who tends to roam is Peter. He's had a low weight gain today, only 0.1 ounce, but the way he moves, he's probably burning up all his calories. I've seen him nursing. I've never seen a kitten that young move that much. So he's going to be a strong one. He's working those muscles. Okay, that's it for Q&A for now. Oh, she got, he got plopped on. He's hissing at mama. You landed on me, mom. But don't worry if mama lays on the kittens. They tend to squeak really loud, and she's like, oh, my bad. Sorry. Oh, he's falling asleep against mama's neck. Wrong way. Wrong way, big man. Yeah, you notice that Peter Vickman in the movie was always the one that was non-stop talking, non-stop moving. Peter is aptly named. Go on and get some milk there, boy. Quit moving and get drinking. Peter Vigner never did like following the rules. Okay, I'm just going to sit here quietly, do some reading, so I'm going to get used to me being around.
Sorry, Mom. With my cell phone. I had to weigh in already today. Ray is up 0.2 ounces. Egon is up 0.8. And Peter's up 0.1. He's the super active one. He's nursing right now. He was until he flopped over. She has that, I'm going to swat you look. I've learned her body language. I'm just going to let her get used to me here. No, weight chart is not posted yet. She gets a lot more friendly after I pop a can of cat food, though.
one of the kittens is meowing in his sleep. I can barely hear that in my, and I'm right here so you guys can hear that the mic is really good Okay, now we're going to make the gushy food sounds. Well, she's real happy with me now. Here it comes, Mom. Here you go, lady. Bon appetit.
started letting the kittens get used to my scent. If you have a new fancy iPhone, feel it, take the case off of it and feel the weight. That's about the weight of a kitten right now. The gun gained 0.8 ounces. Peter gained 0.1. Ray gained 0.2. That big was mom. There you go, mom. Okay. My butt's falling asleep, so I'm going to go ahead and step out now while she's distracted with the food. Enjoy the kittens. Have a nice day.